Good evening, Facebook Live. Hey, I'm trying this out. I want to see something, see what happens here. All right, so I didn't give it enough time. I see exactly what happened. Came in a little bit late, but it's all good. It's all good. We're back to business as normal after yesterday and all the stuff that uh, took place. If you missed all that, watch the previous YouTube video or Facebook Live video. You can see all that. And we're done with it. We're done with it, and we're moving on. I've had a lot of people come out of the woodwork um and try to it's like it's like the 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 people go after the wounded animal right it's like it's like the the lion waiting for the the weak weak giraffe or something that's uh that's just hobbling but the funny thing is is i wasn't the one that was hobbling so the i was the one that was standing up for what i felt was right and kept rocking it on. So, so what we're going to do here today is I'm going to invite everybody who has a link. I don't care what business you're in. I don't care what you're promoting. I want you to go ahead and in my video right here in this uh, chat, put the link to your business. Heck, type up a little thing about your business. Put in there. Put in there how long you've been doing it, why you're doing it. Put in there your why. Type in the the chat why you're doing your business and the link because I want to do a promoter parade let's see if we can start the hashtag promoter parade and get everybody sharing everybody's stuff because we should be you know it's small business Saturday right and if you're online you should be shopping at each other's stuff I don't care if you're you're promoting health and wellness jewelry products candles bags it, it's not always about you just selling. Who are you supporting? Who is it that you're going out and helping build their business? Who are you going out and, and helping motivate people to get bigger and better in their in their in their ventures? There's one. The first one. I don't don't think the I don't think the link went through very well, uh, Alusha. Uh, it's a weird weird link. So, <clears throat> but anyways. So we're, uh, we just got done spending the day hanging out with our buddies, stayed the night down in Huntington, West Virginia. Um, and it is a lot of fun to talk to someone and try to promote being better than average. <clears throat> My best friend was the, the first person who told us no in our network marketing business. That, and it was our first major, major setback. I don't know if you've ever had a first setback or if you got busy in your in your first network marketing business and then you instantly said no uh, or the person you showed the first the very first person the person who you knew was your hottest market I mean the person that you never dreamed would tell you no and then they tell you no to your face they tell you that ain't gonna work around here oh you just wasted your money you're just wasting your time that's one of those things that's one of those pyramid schemes. That's one of those things that's going to take all your money. Only the people at the top make money. Only the people at the top are getting paid. I don't think that's the case, but the funny thing is, in my first network marketing venture, it took me a year and four months to put in eight people. Eight people. How many in here right now with a show of a hand, raise, give me a raised hand icon, if you would have quit after a year and four months and only eight people joined your business, let me see who would have quit. Let's see where my quitters are. The raise hands a year and four months. If you couldn't sell your product or service, would you have quit? I'm looking because it was it for us a year and four months. I, I, I was just, I, I was stuck. I didn't know what to do. And then I got fearless. I got a, not afraid of the of the word no. I let go of the emotional attachment to the no. And I became passionate about the show. I became passionate about telling people what I had to offer. Showing people a solution to a problem. Showing people what we were excited about because we were doing it. I don't believe in promoting a product or service that I personally wouldn't use myself. So um, 
I don't talk about it much. Uh, we got started in our first health and well. I got started my first health and wellness company um, weeks ago, and I don't I don't promote it. It's on CurryRussell.com if you're going to go figure out what I do secretly. Um, but I used the product before I became a rep because I figured if I was going to share it, I was going to make money. But I refused to share it if it wasn't going to have any value to me. And it, but I love it. I truly enjoy it. I enjoy what it does for me. It's, it has solved a major problem in my life and I love it. And I didn't even take it for weight loss, but I know the moment I start trying to lose weight, I'm going to make huge gains because of the products and services that I'm using. What else we got in here? Viseo is in the house. We got T Tanya Tucker doing Viseo. Stacy, I know you are rocking uh, Lavelle, rocking it. But after, but after the, the the point of that whole thing about the, my past was the moment I got past the no and I got past the concern of the outcome. I got past all that. I put sixty people in my business. 60 people without in an up without an upline yelling at me or an upline motivating me without people you know coming to my support and me me asking them questions all the time trying just figuring it out and just showing more people over 60 people join my business the next year now that's still not you know gigantic numbers that's 60 people that's a lot i mean uh, you do the math, that's like five per month, right? I mean, that's a lot for some people. I mean, the average network marketer puts about four people in their business. Four people. It, the average network marketer quits their business. The average, 97% of people quit. So if you only enroll four, three of those are going to quit for sure. That Possibly all four. So if you enroll four, or if you enroll 100, 97 will quit and three will stay. But those three will make you a millionaire. Are you willing to go put in the work to show a 1,000 to find the 100 to find the three? Because that's what it's about. It's about truly finding the 100 to find the three. Those three people will become your best friends, the people that you run the rest of your life with, the people that you develop relationships with and, and you spend time with their grandkids and seeing their grandkids just grow up because they're the ones that are going to help you create a legacy. But most people won't give it a year in their business. Most people won't put their link in this video. I mean, look at this. I've been asking. There's some in here, a couple of them. Uh, but it, listen, this is the pr promoter parade, people. Go put your link in here. Put your about your business. Type your message in here about what you got going on. Put in here what you're excited about. Most people won't even promote their business for free. I've got a small following. And so I know that people who jump on here are going to see all the links that are listed and want to share it, click on it, find out what's going on, see who they can help. And if you have it, ladies, if you're on here and you're doing, doing, if you at least put some makeup on your face, you should talk to my friend, Missy Bowles. I mean, she's one of the top people in, in uh, Unique. She's doing such an incredible job. Put, put some of that stuff on your face. Put, have her get some of that uh, epic mascara. That stuff is crazy. That stuff is like truly like a magic wand. I don't even understand what it does, but I, I don't know. It's got super glue or something in it to make your eyelashes like grow 47% more or something. I don't know the numbers. I don't sell it. I just remember my wife going in and one of her eyes, it looked like it was like 70 times bigger on one eye because it was so incredible. It's popping. It's popping. The other eye was... It was not, it was okay. It was, it was just okay. You know, it, God gave her one and unique gave her the other. And I don't know. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I got a sore throat here. Hold on a second. So, once we got past the nose, once we got past 
getting no's and and uh, going for no all the time, it became a fun game of how many people I could show <clears throat> to get farther. And then we found OSP and Online Sales Pro taught me how to market online a lot better and developed ways to capture leads organically you know almost almost 3,000 leads in a year um, have filled out my forms and got into my mailing list and now I can market to them whenever and however I want they, they, they can drop out anytime they want all I gotta do is click unsubscribe it's not like I'm trying to, I'm keeping them hostage um, but they I can market to them as much as I want and when you learn to develop leads, see, I didn't do that at the beginning. I wasn't, I was more concerned about trying to force my links down people's throats and blasting my links all over Facebook and talking about my opinion and blah, blah, blah. It was never about developing the leads. But when I started capturing leads and I started being able to learn how to market online better and I started helping a community, I got... I got started getting a little bit of a following, a little bit of a following. And now, over the last nine months, is today the 10th yet? Today is the 10th. Happy anniversary to uh, Tina Malsum. Today is nine months that we've been in a Serbia. I didn't know that until right now. Nine months that I've been in a Serbia. And when we did that, um, I went out and in 13 days and enrolled a um, hundred people in 13 days. But my skill set had changed. My focus had changed. And I knew what my target market was. And now I've enrolled 250 something people and have a team of 6,500. And that's not bragging. It's not bragging. I'm just saying it's hard work. It's developing your skill set, reading books, changing your mindset, and just stop caring about the outcome. It's stop just I don't know why we why we worry about what's gonna happen on the outcome. What what's supposed to happen? Hey Jen Wright, John Bone, he's got that free trial offer for OSP. Go go ahead and sign up with John Bone's free trial offer instead of mine. Go ahead, click that, click that link for him. Let's see what else we got. Pearl's in here. Pearl, you ain't kidding. That epic, epic mascara is incredible. Nikki Adams, it's good to see you. Uh, Chris Salmondon. That's a very awesome name, sir. That is a very nice. Nice to see you, Lisa. Charity, good to see you. Guys, share this link if you think it's going to help because I'd love for you to share the link that promotes the uh, promoter parade. We need to get more people sharing and sharing and sharing within the community because there's got to be something out there that on a Saturday afternoon you've been looking for. I just watched a video about socks. I never even didn't even know there was a, a network marketing company for socks. And now I just found out uh, Mr. George Nasser's got a got a video for uh, Vox, Vox socks, V-O-X-X. -X. And you can buy like good socks to help your feet. And that was pretty neat. I've found all kinds of network marketing companies. Some of them I just can't even understand. Uh, I personally will never understand. Uh, uh, the, there's a Lady Lady Products network marketing company. I, I am glad there is one. I'm glad that there's the op option for women. Um, I won't understand ever how men are the primary promoters of it. I can't, I, listen, it, you guys are so much better than me. So much better than me because I couldn't do it. I, I couldn't do it. I couldn't promote that product if you paid me. Oh, well, I guess they're getting paid. I couldn't do it even for money. Like there's no possible way. I'd never make it through, never make it through a presentation. I would be dying laughing the whole time. <laughs> there's no, no possible way. Carlise, it's good to see you. Let's see what else we got here. Daniel Kump over here rocking the house, buddy. I ain't seen you in a while. Good to talk to you. Glad to see you. Manathis Rich Jr., all the way from, uh, well, not Hawaii anymore. He's down in Florida. Florida. Michelle Spain just jumped into the party. Seville Co. is in here. Congratulations on your new baby, sir. Uh, Marine Kittle Loveman, good to see you. 
Uh, Monica, good to see you. Good to see you. We're going to throw out some more shout outs here. Drop the link to your business. Tell me why you're doing it. Put it in the put it in the chat. Why you're growing your business. What it is you love about your product, your service. Tell people how it's solving a problem in in your life. How you are using it to benefit your own life. Because if you're only doing your product to make money, uh, quit. I'm just telling you, don't. It's not. That's not going to make help you win. If you're doing your product because it's solving a problem in your own life, then you have a testimony, and you're not going to quit your product because it's actually solved a problem for your life. It's actually no, Carly. There's no possible way. I just got stopped in my entire conversation. There's no way. I no. Uh-uh, no. There is a lot of things out there that I could do really well. Um, I could probably promote health and wellness really well, especially when I'm working out and I'm actually like a representative of the products and services. Um, that one, I can't be a product of the product. There's no possible way. Uh, I got nothing to do with it. I have no possible use of it. I can't, I can't do it. I can't, I can't do it. Good to see Cindy Teagues in the house. Mike Feathers, Gary Hole just jumped into the bit, jumped into the show. Michelle Spain, one of my favorite rock stars in the world, she is now uh, rocking and rolling with a, another new company that's coming to the United States, doing some jewelry stuff. Got some real nice watches. I just looked at some watches. Maybe she'll cut me a deal on a watch or something. Um, John Bone tried a perfume company. That's amazing, John, because I know how big of a human being you are. You are a monster of a man. I mean, John Bone's like 62.7 feet tall. He is he is a giant uh, stature. He's strong as an ox. The dude is huge. Here, ladies, let me let me spritz you with this. Let me. I can see John just rocking the perfume business. He is he's crazy. That guy's crazy. What else we got down here? Missy Bowles. Listen, there you go. Changing lives. Uh, Cindy. A five-year-old. That is awesome, Manathis. That is great. Karen, you're not on replay. We're live, dear. You don't have to say on replay when we're live. I'm gonna tap. I'm gonna pin that post because that's hilarious. You, the little live thing is still in the window, and you're not on replay. She she's watching in the future, I guess. I don't know. She must have posted that in the future. So go ahead. Once you like, I said. Post your comment. Talk about why you're doing your business. Melinda just went above and beyond. Did her whole thing. Uh, she is doing her uh, business to solve the problem of generational poverty and to enable the masses to get paid to save gold and help others do the same. I thought Carrot Bars was going out of business, but that was my... I mean, I have to look that research up, but apparently you're rocking. Congratulations. Hope it's rocking for you. Hope you're really, really doing well. I had no clue that it was still, uh, no, that was one coin. One coin was shut down the other day. That, that was the one that was the gigantic company shut down. Another one. This week alone, companies be just, FTC's coming after everybody, guys. If you're promoting money, over the product or service, the FTC is going to shut you down. That's just, there's no possible way. If, you com if your company doesn't have a product or service, or if you have a, if you're in a business where there's more representatives than there are customers, that's another sign that you're probably going to be investigated by the FTC. But if you're out there pushing a product that's actually being used, eat by people who have no interest in being part of the business, but they're actually using the product as the product for no other reason but for that product, man, you're good to go. That's a business. That's a direct sales company. Congratulations, you win. But if you're out there promoting money over the, the business or the business over the product, I'm telling you, FTC is coming. What else we got? Michelle Spain, I am excited for you. I saw you showing off your, your new stuff for a few minutes. Melinda, when you're dealing with when you're dealing with gold, I would hope so. I hope they got all the gold. I really do. Blankets and household products. Somebody's over here buzzing me. 
uh, we'll find out what that is. Petra joined. Hi, Petra. Uh, it is Ivy. The it is the uh, it is the best business ever. I truly agree. I, I've had a great time doing. It. Guys, I'm excited that you were here. If you want to continue doing this through the replay, continue putting your links in. Continue putting your uh, products and service in. Talk about your testimony as to why you're doing it. Um, talk about how you got started. Talk about the person who invited you, whether you were invited by somebody on Facebook, a friend at a party, you went to a, an event. Tell, tell the world how you got started because by you giving your testimony, it's going to encourage other people to go do those types of activities to find more people because people think that they can only do things the way they were shown how to do it. But if they realize there's other ways out there, so, you know, using Facebook Messenger, using Facebook groups, going out to your local store and just saying hi to somebody. Hey, I noticed that you got a sticker on your car about your business. I'd love to find out how you're doing your marketing. If you show people a better way or a different way, they might go a gigantic step farther, right? They might. They just might. So, guys, I am going to shut this down, and we will talk to you um, on our 9 o'clock Zoom. If you ha have a uh, business, if you have a network marketing business of any kind, a direct sales company, uh, insurance, car salesman, Jump on over at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Jump on over to showmemore.live, www.showmemore.live. Somebody type that in there for me. Somebody type that in the chat, www.showmemore.live. If you have a business, bring your business to us and let us see if we can show you how you can market that business a little bit better. I'll talk to you at 9 p.m., guys. Talk to you soon.